One of the things we love about the My Viewboard whiteboard software is the ability to open and operate our document camera directly in the software. I don't have to switch inputs or do anything like that. Now, in order to get started with this, we're gonna need a USB enabled document camera. I have a ViewSonic one here, but you can use any USB document camera. Now make sure that your document camera is either plugged into the front ports of the board or if you're running whiteboard on a standalone device like just your laptop, go ahead and plug that document camera into your laptop. That's how the whiteboard software knows where the document camera is. Next, we're gonna open the whiteboard software and you'll see here, I've already drawn an arrow down to this icon in the main toolbar. You should be familiar with this icon, but this is what we call the magic box and it's like our import tool. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna import the document camera into the whiteboard. So up at the very top, you're gonna to see all these different little icons. The fourth icon over looks like a red lamp. This is actually the document camera icon. And when we select it, you're gonna see here that there's a document camera in the list. If I'm on a laptop, you might see other webcams and other cameras that are connected to your device. So I'm gonna select the document camera and you'll see here that it instantly starts showing whatever is underneath my document camera here. Now by default, the whiteboard software is going to use a low resolution, even though the document camera is capable of a much higher resolution. I can move this window around wherever I want it to be. And we're just gonna come down here and we're going to increase the resolution of our document camera in this drop down list. And you can see now it's a little easier for me to see what is underneath my camera. So obviously this is live. I can flip through whatever I need to, show whatever I need to show. But what I love about the ability of using our document camera in the whiteboard software is one, I can enable the pen tool, which is down here in the bottom right corner, which allows me to write and or annotate directly over the window. Or better yet, what I like to do is if we come in here, we can actually use the camera lens, which is just right here. You can see there's a camera lens icon there. We call this the screen capture tool. And when I press that, what it does is it's actually going to grab a picture of whatever is underneath my document camera, and it's gonna add it to the whiteboard canvas, allowing me to manipulate it, annotate over it, those kinds of things. So you can see using your document camera with whiteboard is super easy, super simple. And of course, everything that comes into your whiteboard, you can then save and share with any of your participants.